me, it was just, it was watching the 49ers yesterday. And we got caught up in like the 49ers and the quarterback stuff with the Trey Lance and the Jimmy G. And all oh, Trey Lance is hurt. Oh, Jimmy G. Now they're stuck with Jimmy G. The bottom line through all that, and I was texting back and forth with Sam Flannel last night. Nick Bosa, bro. Nick Bosa is one of those franchise-changing players. You're going to win some games because Nick Bosa is your defensive end. Do you think he was instrumental in the 49ers winning that game last night? Absolutely. He absolutely was. He harassed Matthew Stafford all day and got two sacks. Even in game two in the first half against the Commanders for the Lions when Aiden Hutchinson was constantly harassing Carson Wentz and had three sacks, the Lions pitched a shutout in that half and won the game. That's how important defensive ends are. And it also speaks to the fact that for 14 out of the 16 quarters, Aiden Hutchinson has been largely a non-factor. For as has Charles as Harris. As has Charles Harris, and that has severely... I have, to, I have to qualify that all the time or I get labeled a hater. Sorry. Absolutely, but that has severely <laughs> hurt the Lions' defense. I mean, imagine if Charles Harris and Aiden Hutchinson made one play against Seattle. They'd probably win that game if they make one play yeah, against force, the Vikings. And force one punt. One... Oh my... <laughs> That's just <laughs> biblical, man. Geno Smith put up 41 but, points uh, on Jim the Jim Harbaugh in the yeah. sound booth here wait, today. Wait, wait. Did, you say, uh, did you say Tom Brady, Aaron Rodgers? Who was the quarterback? Geno Smith. Oh, Geno Smith. Geno Smith. Geno. G- oh, I, man, I thought Geno Smith had Geno's uh <laughs> That's an ape boy. Geno's cheesesteaks in Philly. Yeah. I'm salty. Jeff says legend. I'm salty too. Uh, I'm salty. Says uh, our linebacker core is probably the worst in the league. And, and look, guys, not probably. I, I I get that, and I understand that. But again, the defensive ends and the edge rushers are the quarterbacks of the defense. If they make plays, you can win games. You can get away with this. Yeah. For real. Oh yeah. Guys, for real. I'm being serious, and this is an honest to God take. I honest to God believe this. I think the Lions could get away with it and at least be two and two, dare I say two and two, if the defensive ends would make some plays. Yes. Just thousand just, percent. Just all play. We but you remember we saw that in the first game too. And hopefully here's the thing. I'm gonna caveat it with this. Four four National Football League games, if we're talking about Aiden Hutchinson or, you know, this defense and that. So they have to get better. We have to see improvement. In the last two games, we hadn't. 